How do you make concrete set up faster? <laughs> if you need concrete to set up faster, then you're looking for an accelerant admixture. This accelerant when added to the concrete is going to achieve a faster initial set time. The reason why this is most commonly used is for cold weather applications. You pour the concrete and it's starting to get hard slowly, oh, but then everything freezes and the surface layer of the concrete is ruined because it's, it's not strong enough yet to be exposed to any sort of external forces like that. That is where an accelerant comes into play. You add it to the concrete, it dramatically increases how fast the concrete achieves that initial strength. The final strength, the final cure strength of the concrete is going to be same, or almost the same in either case, but with an accelerant, you're going to get hard faster earlier in the, in the uh, or earlier after you've placed and finished it. If you can make the concrete hard and fast enough, you can avoid the damage associated with freezing weather. To the same effect, when you accelerate concrete, you accelerate the chemical reaction that's hardening it. And as a result, it creates heat. I mean, it creates heat anyway, but it creates more heat when you use an accelerant. That actually kind of works when you're doing a cold weather pour. You use an accelerant because you want the concrete to set up faster, but also as a result, now it's making extra heat and that's going to help to protect it against the potential damage from freezing. You certainly don't want fresh or green concrete freezing. If it freezes, you almost certainly ruined it. So what is concrete accelerant? Commonly, calcium chloride. When added to a concrete mix at no greater than 2% by mix volume, calcium chloride will drastically increase the rate at which the concrete gets hard. The problem is there's no free lunch. Adding calcium chloride can contribute to a number of different potential deficiencies with concrete. So that's why we don't just use it all the time. You only use it if you have to and you only use the minimum amount. It's very corrosive. It can lead to staining issues or leaving a mottled look and that could be a problem if it's any sort of decorative concrete application. There also can be potential issues with scaling and strength ish, uh, problems if too much calcium is added. So it's, it's something that's used sparingly and only when absolutely needed. In the event that calcium chloride can't be used because there's some decorative ap applications that that would be a problem, there are some non-calcium based accelerants available for concrete, though they are vastly less common than calcium chloride. I hope you found this information helpful.